We'll guide you through how to motion track in CapCut. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, add the video to a CapCut project. Then go to the bottom and you want to go and select text and click add text. And you want to just go and put in a dot like so, as we're using this as a reference point. Then all you want to do is pinch on it to make it bigger. And you want to go and place it in the middle of the video, as I said, for a reference point like this. Then all you want to do is make sure it goes throughout the whole video. So drag it like this and then go and select the video you want to motion track. Go right to the start of the video and go to the right of the play pause button and go and click on the diamond. That'll go and place a keyframe. You'll go and see it in the video timeline. Now go to where you want to go and start the tracking, which for me is where the ball is thrown, just here. And at that point, you can just go and start zooming in or out and positioning it where you want it to be. A keyframe will automatically add it as you already added one before. And you can then go and set the position just like so. And you can then slowly move your way through the video and keep on moving your position by using a reference point. And when you do that, another keyframe should automatically be added. So yeah, keep moving. You can zoom in and out as well. And you can just keep repeating the steps. I've now finished. And then what you can do is go and select the dot layer at the bottom and press delete. Now when we play it back, you'll go and see we've motion tracked the ball. It's that simple. 